Well, good morning. Thanks for your beautiful singing now and earlier as well, getting us centered in these hopes and promises we have in this Advent season. Well, in the reading we just heard, the prophet Isaiah says that we are set forth as a light to the nations. I wonder what the prophet Isaiah means by that, being set as a light to the nations. Well, let's talk about light for a few minutes. Do you see any lights in this sanctuary? Point if you see some lights. Up there, right? Well, I am happy to report that we are 100% lit in our sanctuary today. Light bulbs were replaced this week, folks. So we are 100% lit. Not one burnt out bulb in this sanctuary today. Awesome. Well, let's see. So we have that kind of light. But what happens if these lights go out? What if the electricity went off and those lights went out? Imagine for a minute that the lights from the tree went out and there's a light behind the cross up there. Let's imagine that that went out. Would there still be any light? Yeah, where's the light coming from? There's some, yep, some from the outdoors. Even though it's a dreary day, kind of dark, there's still light outside in the daytime. Where where else? I see some pointing back here. What, what's, all, what's lit behind you? The candles, right? So what's the difference between the lights up there and the candlelight? Yeah, what's the difference? Right, the lights are from electricity and the candles are fire. They're a natural light and this is an artificial light, right? Well, today we come together to worship the true light the light that we have in Jesus. And that's a light that shines even brighter than our artificial lights or lights from candles. And in just about a week and a half, we'll come together on a Christmas Eve night and we'll have candles like this and we'll light them and we'll sing Silent Night and we'll say again and proclaim that Jesus is the light of the world and the light of our lives. And that's the light we get to share with others that shines from each one of you. And that is such good news for us today. So let's pray. Can you fold your hands and close your eyes and bow your head and repeat after me? Dear God, thank you for being the light. Thank you for giving us Jesus, the true light. Help us to shine his light to everyone we meet. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for coming forward today. Shine your light. Shine your light. 